It's your boy, Head Coach Ross with Tax Gyms, the street warrior himself coming at you. You know what I'm saying? Talking about uh, my fighting, uh, family's fighting system in Gia Uhuru Kipura. In Gia Uhuru means the way of freedom. Kipura is the correct name, the Kikongo term from the Congo. Kikongo meaning the language that was spoken in the Congo, which is a country in Africa, f from which the, co the art that's miscalled and mispracticed capoeira springs from. Okay, now I'm answering some of you guys' questions. You guys ask me some questions. I'm, you know, this is the Shots Fire series. You gave me some questions, and some of them, some of them were aggressive questions by some of the, my detractors. And some of my, uh, some of my very, very intelligent, non-racist, open-minded, logical, analytical uh, followers were asking that same question. Like, hey, wait a minute, you know, why is that? That is a good question. Even though it was disrespectfully phrased, it's a good question. All right. Well, one of the things they asked me was, hey, why do you use the name Capoeira? In, in your on all your social media, if you say capoeira is garbage and you know you should be saying kipura, the answer is old school. All right, I'm using u danganyifu, which is a Swahili term. All right, it means deception. It really, really translation in English means deception. There's nowhere near what it actually means. It's cultural means much more comprehensive than that. It is the ability to take every piece of information that you have in your entire life. From no matter what walk or area or uh, facet of study you had or interaction that you had, and those that you that, that you've learned from other people and apply it to every single level of whatever it is you're doing right now. All right, what that means here in English is, I realize that those idiot racist uh, corrupt uh, heads in the in the Brazilian government, all right, spent over a hundred years lying about the art, but in the process of lying it, they spread it worldwide. So I figured, hey, you know what? I'm gonna jump upon their propaganda machine and turn it back on itself. I'm gonna use that word capoeira to draw people's attention because the moment I say capoeira, that doesn't separate me from a zillion other people who say capoeira. What separates me is my techniques, my knowledge, my, my authenticity, the fact that I'm not BSing you. And I'm actually answering the questions that you're too polite to ask your mystery. Like, that don't look like it'll work. If you say this is a war, this is people did, did a dance fight and they were fighting and the slaves after slaves, how do they do that when the stuff you're doing has zero app application to the here and now? And the here and now is nowhere near as bad as it was back then. That's why I'm using capoeira. In, and I tell you, hey, once you get here, I start educating you correctly. The correct word is kipura. This capoeira shouldn't be used. It's Portuguese, da 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 da. Now, there is actually also a very strong uh, African tradition within so called Brazil which does the same thing. But then, which, but they don't use the word udangan 